What is up, everyone? It is I coming at you with another unboxing video. I just wanted to, because I just wanted to make this unboxing video for you real fast. Today we are going to unbox. Today we are, today we are going to unbox. Philips 4K Blu-ray, Philips 4K, 4K player, Blu-ray, and DVD player, all in one. Sorry, no CD. It doesn't say anything about playing a CD. But Roger, do you, Ramen, do you have a 4K TV? No. I just bought it, I just bought it so I can watch Blu-rays and DVDs on a, on a 4K television. Where I, where the hell you get this thing? Walmart from. Price, probably. Probably $150. Was it really worth it? Well, only time will tell. Only time will tell. Only time will tell. Let's see. Kind of open it up without destroying the box. Without destroying the box. Is there any way to see this slide out? Come on. You know you're going to slide out. It's still taped, yeah, you see that piece of tape. But there you go, now the box is open. There you go. You have the 4K player itself. It probably costs so much because it got a bunch of streaming apps on it, like Netflix, Amazon Prime, blah blah blah, I connect to your Wi Fi. You want to set that up for streaming services like YouTube? Never all that stuff. Oh, well, yep, it's a unit itself. It are the instructions. The most important part is you don't understand anything. Read the instructions. You can't comprehend how to set up a 4K player. Slide, slide, put it in slide. Now let's just go for this. Let's go for this first. And there you have, there you go, you have your unit itself, your 4K player, your 4K player, with your HDMI output, outputs in 4K, your Ethernet output for your internet, and that's about it, that's about it, there's not really much in the way of buttons like an eject or a play button, it's a USB port for me, yet. there it is, it's an eject button and a power button, that's all the rest, well the rest of the buttons is on, the rest of the buttons is on, this, the remote, the remote that controls everything. Yes, Netflix is your friend. So is Video, so is Video, and YouTube, and audio, and all these other remote settings. Does it come with batteries in the remote? No, it takes two AAA batteries. It's like, come Nope. Nope. Well, that's on the box. That's on the box. I'm gonna set that back here. I'm gonna set that back here. Watch it on a 4K player. Well, it was the only thing they had at Walmart, and I just feel like oh, they didn't have the Blu-ray version. Uh, you know, speaking of 4K movies, 4K Ultra movies, I didn't see a bunch of them. I mostly see DVDs. There you go. It's a Detective Pikachu movie licensed by the Pokemon Company on DVD. Warner Brothers, Warner Brothers. Not much, not much inside here. This tells you what you get. Pika, Pika, Pikachu. Pikachu can talk. It's rated PG. It just tells me that in the bottom. Let's see, it has your English audio. 
I can't read all those, but I'm not gonna try to read all those on camera. I'm gonna unbox this. Next is, next is we have Voltron, the complete series, the complete series. Or, as you might know in Japanese, as Go Lion. This is the complete series it contains. Let's see, it contains. I think it says in the box. Yep, it contains all 72 episodes of Botron. That means all four seasons, four, three, that were ever animated in Japan. It's one of the first animes I watched that wasn't an anime because I didn't realize it was dub when I watched it as a little black kid. To me, it was just a cartoon. The animation looked as normal as any other cartoon during the 80s when I was a little kid, so I didn't really consider it to be anything else more than a cartoon. Voltron, Defender of the Universe. Oh yeah, you can tell this is really old 80s Voltron. I mean, look, you can tell this is really old 80s Voltron or Gold Lion. Look at that. Look at that. Was, look at those 80s screenshots. Look at those screenshots. You guys want to see the DVDs themselves. Let's see here. You want to see the DVDs themselves. You got DVD Volume 1, Volume 2, 3 and 4, 5 and 6, 5 and 6, and the part one has bonus features on it. And you have a you have a little list underneath here that tells you what's on all the episodes 1, episodes 2, episodes 2. Well that DVD doesn't have much. It's not really made of there's not really much of bonus features on here, but you know, it didn't cost me all that much to buy this, but I think it was like 20 bucks. I think it was like 20 bucks. So yeah. Now let's I don't know how much on less, so I did not pay attention when it was being round up about how much it cost anyway. You know what I want to do? You know what I want to do? I want to listen to some stuff with your slim. It ain't got nothing to do with this unboxing video. Alright, it's a nigga that calls so slim. But now I say what's up, but y'all say what's happening. What's up, what's happening? What's up, what's happening? Now the name of this shit is called What's Up, What's Happening? What's up, what's happening? Uh. You don't know who Soldier Slim was? He was a rapper who for No Limit. He passed away. He passed, he passed away early on in his rap career. He was teen. He passed away. But for now, I'm going to vote for my favorite type of 90s rap music too. And we're crossing for the Switch. The game that Club Met, J62 won't stop talking about, and Ron Mytho won't stop tweeting about it. Everybody, everybody's tweeting about this from the Switch or Facebook. Yeah, Animal Crossing, ready to eat for everyone. Admittedly, I just got this game, I just got this game because it looked good. I just got this game because it looked good. And that's why I had to go into a room and retrieve my Switch. Animal Crossing New Horizons, will I enjoy it like everyone else or will all the hype just pass me by? Really? The truth is, I got a lot of games. I got a lot of games that I might not even have time to play this. Man, it has that brand new smell on my DVDs. Not a DVD, but a game. A game. Made by Nintendo. It even comes with it. It even comes with packaging art. It got a lot of packaging art. I think it was made by Duro Airlines. Duro Airlines. Nook Inc. I wonder who developed it. I wonder who made this game for Nintendo. I wonder what kind of it probably says on the back of it anyway. I just ought to get myself a physical copy. Yeah, I should. I don't have Pokemon Sun and Moon. And I'm sorry. It's not that I, ever, it's not that I grew bored with Pokemon. It's just that. I don't know. I don't know. I just don't see the need to pick them up right now. I'll probably buy them eventually and play them. A, B, C. Let me see. This game. Yeah, it was made by Nintendo. I don't see any third party developer. Hello, life is on your island. To be frankly, I play Animal Crossing, Animal Crossing Amiibo Festival for the Wii U. I play Animal Crossing New Leaf for 3DS. So yeah, I don't think I played the original Animal Crossing on GameCube. That's just Animal Crossing itself, but I can't wait to play this. You know what we should do? We should install this bad boy on my Switch. Cause my Switch is saying, install, install, install. There you go. 
Animal Crossing. I'm not gonna check and see if there's an update because even if there was one, I'll download later. Yeah, it's all set up and ready to go. It's all set up and ready to go. I can play it later on my Switch when there's time. You know what I'm gonna go do? You know what I'm gonna go do? I'ma go, I'ma go, look up that song, I'm gonna look up that song. What's up, what's happening my soldier slam and listen to that? Listen to that old rap school song. Then, then maybe I might hook up then maybe I might set up this 4K player anyway. And do something with it. Maybe I might set But for right now, for now, right now, this video is over and I am done. You know? Oh yeah, by the way. There were batteries that came with the remote. I just set them down on the table. I just didn't see them until now. So yeah. Yeah. So yeah. I hope you guys have a nice day. You take it easy. You guys chill out and relax. And I'll see you in my next, in my next unboxing video. In my next unboxing video or just showing off stuff video or whatever you want to call it video or